Oh, look at that. I think Bob Ross would be proud. If you don't know who Bob Ross is, go check him out. He's fantastic. As you can see here, we don't have any mistakes. What we have here is, as Bob Ross would say, we'll have happy accidents. <laughs> but anyways, guys, welcome back. This is going to be a rant video, so short and sweet, hopefully. Um, hopefully I don't lose any subscribers over this one. Anyways, guys, I'm just out in the garden, sending it with a typhoon today. Getting some more use out of this amazing ramp that I built. Uh, oh, my days, it sends it, man. It's unbelievable. I've never had so much fun in my back garden with an RC car. Oh, I'm actually clearing now on the length of the garden now. So that's how much practice I've had yesterday. I had plenty of practice. Just getting used to the throttle and the jump yeah. runs away in the wind. So I need to come up with a fixer for that. Um, and I've got a good fix, I think. And speaking so, of fixes, I've got a bit of a rant coming. Um, so you guys will know a YouTuber called Drifter Maniacs. Uh, and I've just watched him. He's just put a video out not so long ago saying something about his uh, his one two four solution that he's put out for the bearings or something like that. Um, frankly, it's not his idea. Like I had that idea out ages ago. Um, you know, I've been getting good shout outs. I'm a tiny little YouTuber trying to yeah, you know, just put some good con out there, content out there. Sorry, get some fixes for you guys and your cars. That's what my YouTube channel's about. It's about the fixes and stuff. Um, and I feel as though Rich from Drifter Maniacs is just ripping us off by saying that it's his fix um, that he's came up with. And quite frankly, it's not. Um, yeah. It's starting to rain here, guys, but I want to get a few more jumps. Nice. Not bad for a cardboard jump, like. Gotta admit, I'm really, very really proud of myself. Um, speaking of proud of yourself, how can you be proud of yourself on YouTube when it comes to content, right? So like, content's content, the stuff I'm doing now, pulling jumps for you guys, right? That's content to me, yeah? But then, coming up with a fix, right? Like a solution to your problems, that's like uh, someone's claim, you know what I mean? Claim to that content in a sense, and then if someone uses it or uses that idea, it's always nice to get like a little bit of a shout out, isn't it? You know what I mean? I don't know if you guys agree with that. However, Drifter Maniacs, right? So, oh, not very PC when it comes to, to rant videos and stuff like that. So, unfortunately, this one's more like a Drifter Maniacs call out because of this whole bearing crap that he's saying that he came up with with uh, the 124. No, he didn't. Definitely not. Like, um, I think when people need credit, these big YouTubers should give little YouTubers uh, a bit more credit like, for where they're getting their ideas from and stuff. Seems like everybody else does it, the bigger YouTubers do it, you know. Kev, uh, Kev Talbot, he's constantly seeing V2 vids, rada rada rada, you know what I mean? Um, but I this Drifter Maniacs anyways, he's a proper bozo um, for saying that it's his idea, whatever. No, it's not. It's be. It's you know. It is. I put the content out there ages ago on that uh, bearing idea. So I don't know why he's coming up with that stuff. The bloke's a proper rip off. Like I say, I'm not very PC when it comes to rant videos or holding me tongue, as it were. I've often getting wrong in life, um, but tough. That's just where life is. Um, I think it's disgusting. Like one person who's basically made my youtube channel grow and that's tommy rc uh, because he done a little shout out saying YouTube out of all and rc is meant to be about fun however when people are just ripping little youtubers off and not even giving them so much as a, a shout out you know what i mean like oh he has such and such i got this idea off whatever fantastic you know what i mean oh look at that little bit of damage there just in the top but it's held up pretty well though, I've got to admit. I'm impressed with this cardboard stuff. Um, yeah, if you like that, like, comment, share and subscribe. 
sorry about the rant, but I just don't like it when you're kind of getting ripped off when someone's saying, oh, I've done this, I've done that, when you're blatantly not, they haven't done that. So, anyways, guys, catch you on the next one.